I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on polynomials, application to represent area. The question here is, a pitcher measures 20 cm by 30 cm. Mat around the pitcher is x cm wide in the pitcher frame. Write a polynomial that represents the total area of the pitcher frame and part B is, calculate the total area of the pitcher frame if the uniform width of the mat is 5 centimeters. You can always pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Now, here we are talking about two things. One is uh, a big picture frame. Right, let me just uh, sketch one like this. Let's say this is a big picture. Now, within this picture, this is the frame of the picture. We have a picture which has uniform border. Right. What does that mean? Mat around the picture is x centimeters. That means x centimeter in this side, all sides, right? x centimeters. You could write like this also. Is that clear to you? So that is the mat around the picture shown in the blue box. The size of the picture is given to us as 20 centimeters by 30 centimeters. That means this side is 20 and the other side is 30. Okay. Now we need to write a polynomial that represents the total area. That means length into width, right? So what is the area of rectangle? Length times width, correct? Now in this case, the length will be how much? Length, let's say this side, it will be the length. We have 30 plus x plus x, right? So that means 2x. So this could be written as 30 plus 2x, clear? Since the mat of x is on the both the sides, as far as the width is concerned, it is 20 plus x plus x, which is 20 plus 2x. That is important to understand, correct? And now we can write that the area will be equal to 30 plus 2x, times 20 plus 2x. Is that clear to you? So part A, write a polynomial that represents the total area of the picture frame. That is this polynomial. Now this is in factored form. You could expand, simplify and write it in a polynomial form also. Let's do that. So if I multiply 30 by 20, I get uh, 600. So let me do it in steps. So we have 30 times 20 plus 30 times 2x plus 20 times 2x plus 2x times 2x. Let me write 2x whole square, right? So which is 600 plus 60x plus 40x plus 4x square, right? So combining like terms, we can write area as 4x squared plus 100x plus 600 unit square. The unit in this case is centimeters. So, so the area expression could be written in standard form. This is called the standard form of the polynomial or in the factored form. So that is our part A. Part B. Calculate the total area of the picture frame with the width as 5 centimeters. So now we can write 5 centimeters for x and calculate, right? So, so let's figure this out. Part b is if x equals to 5, in that case, area will be 4 times 5 square plus 100 times 5 plus 600. Clear? So 4 times 5 squared, 25 times 4 is 100, right? Plus 500 
plus 600. See, 5 square is 25, times 4 is 100, 500. 600, 600, 1200. Centimeter square becomes our answer. Is that clear? So that is how we could actually solve this particular question. We'll have similar questions in our playlist. So I'd like you to go through the playlist and understand how to use polynomials to represent the given situation. I hope that helps. Feel free to write your comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for watching.